Feel like recording this real quick and just putting this in at the beginning of the video so you know what i'm saying but this this episode i really want y'all to realize this shit is just too beautiful like i feel like i had to come back and say this this is me talking y'all before you even see the reaction you know you can go check that out now i'm just, i just want to say it, this shit masterful i'm sorry yeah, let's get back to the show all right what is good y'all welcome back now i ain't gonna lie i forgot the whole speech i had for attack on titan because as y'all know i missed last week's episode in the sense of posting it i watched the episode i was sick if you haven't seen my recent videos i mentioned that i explained the attack on titan thing i was like i tried reacting to it while sick and i just couldn't upload it it was terrible i kept trying to cut it it just was like so not cohesive it was, it was bad but like yeah basically um i want to give my thoughts and i had it actually planned but now I forgot all my thoughts on it because I was having too much fun in this game, Friday Night Funkin'. If you were on my stream, you know what I'm saying, on Twitch, you saw that. But, like, I think I will remember everything I was going to say at the end of this. So, we're going to get straight to the episode, I'll react to this, and then I'll try to recap this episode and last episode, okay? Let's get it. Ayo! Hey, Is she trying to fake a seizure? Or she actually... Oh, my God! You can't trust these kids, bro. I knew it. She... Okay, chill. Oh my god. That is over... She really is this kid female Aaron, dude. Like... Falco, spit, spit some game to her, bro. And I ain't even saying game on some flirty shit. I'm talking about save her, bro. Change her life. Come on, no. She tweaking, but then again, it's understandable. I'm sorry, like, I understand y'all if y'all hate Gabby, but personally, you have to understand me not hating Gabby. I think she's a fire-ass character. <laughs> yeah, well, today is about to be a good-ass day. Let's get it, bro. Oh, yeah. Bro, there's so many bodies getting caught last, um, this season, like, and the craziest part, I do want to say this, though. Aaron was tripping last episode, but it's still, you know what I'm saying? We believe in Aaron's supremacy around here, I ain't gonna cap. Oh, this looks beautiful. Okay, Falco. I'm sorry, bro. You gotta beat her ass, Loki. Facts. It's not. She's so brainwashed. I feel so bad, yo. Yo, that's fire. Wait, chill. Please, chill. Falco, nah. Don't let her kill another kid, bro. They stay trying to look out, bruh. Yo, they both the same thing that fucking Reiner and Bertolt and Andy did. That's fire. Yo, this show is fucking a classic, man. Why is Gabby always on some smoke? Some damn demon time. She want all the smoke. She on her Air Force energy, Black Air Force. Facts, Falco. Come on now. Take the reins to this horse. Not their horse, of course. Why is Falco fire? Yo, this is clean! They on the Harriet Tubman shit. The the Quakers, the... I, I think that's your name, please don't cook me. They got the southern accent. Gabby, you tweaker! Alright, bro, you are really tweaking. I know that's what you've been taught, but... And Falco's like, bitch, you tripping! <laughs> This is so wild. Why is this one scene just bring me so much tension? Attack on Titan is doing the shit, map, bro. That just gave me chills, like, holy shit. One sec, I'm gonna give me a jacket real quick. It's a tiny bit chilly. I'm not gonna lie. If something gets me up really hype and y'all see me with shirts on and a jacket, I'm gonna look real stupid, but you gotta understand. Your boy is skinny and needs to put some weight on these bones, get some muscles, you know what I'm saying? Hit the gym when I can. Ugh. But I got a big ass calves, so like my, my legs are usually warm, but my, my upper body gets cold easily. So like, you know, we ain't gonna talk about that though. All right, let's get back into it. 
This arc is so fire! I love how important every single character is in Attack on Titan. Like, they all have such good character development. <laughs> the revolution, dude. I, I fuck with this right here. This is fire and supremacy, bro. Let's get it. Why is it? Why am I so excited today? Like, this is just so good. Like, the writing just masterful. Every little detail is just hitting right now. There's no lack of point of view for any side. That's what I love about it. He is going through it. Stay determined. Stay determined. That internal conflict be real, but like you got this. Damn. This piano is slapping. They're bringing out all the styles for these characters. Was that a zoom we saw in that episode? Yo, she. Come on now, for my country, we keep it real, we keep it a buck regardless. Ooh, hold up. Ah, oh, the flashbacks to her parents. Yo, he had to kill to save her, so she's yo, this is fire some bro. That's true though. And that's what you're trying to do now, trying to save them by fucking everything up. Not in a bad way fucking everything up, but like icing them. She's like she's like the internal battle and conflict between all these characters and themselves and their morale, like, because there's no right and wrong anymore. It's just like. Ooh. Chill. Why is Gabby look tough though right now? I okay, guess ugly. Do you have no horses there? Come on, bro. All right. I get. See, I bet y'all are eating this episode. Y'all like, man. Fuck Gabby. Fuck Gabby. Fuck. Nah, bro. I'm sorry. I, I still, like. I feel bad. No, it's not, bro. Just, I hate seeing people so lost in their way. Like, bro, please, let, let that man Falco spit to you. Out here in the sticks, we in the boonies. <laughs> Falco is such a real ass character, bro. We don't know his motive. What is he supposed to be, your fucking boyfriend? Like, what? They're about to start learning about the... They're like you, bruh. Come on now. Gabby, calm down, bruh. Oh my god. Facts, like, shut the fuck up. You're tweaking right now. Her voice actor is good, though. Bro, she knows they're from Mars, bro. Oh my, this, yo, did you, did, did, okay, I don't know if that was supposed to be obvious that they want you to catch that, bro. That's what they teach you with Marley, huh? She already knows what they're on, bro, and she's still treating them nice. Like this voice actor is going in right now. Big brain, yo, I love when shit like this. Facts. This is so fire! Oh my, bro. Okay, f okay, I'm really not fucking Gabby. She kills her. I swear to God, this better not get off. She's tweaking. Thank you, Falco. Thank you. I ha! Yo, this character is fire. Kaya's speaking game. Ah. This soundtrack reminds me of Dang and Rampa right now. I'm not gonna lie, if Kaya spits hella game to Gabby though and teaches her like we're just like all low key, we're normal people, and Gabby still doesn't listen, I might not fuck with Gabby as heavy. Like, after a while, it doesn't matter how young you are, you're just being stupid at some point, but you know. Shane, dude, sh see? This systematic racism, like, come on now. Shut. Yo, Falco, see? This is where Falco's about to come in and be so fire! Shut her up! That's true. The past ancestors did do some fucked up shit. But still. But still. But still. Falco, it's your time. Come on now. This dialogue is so. 
Facts? What does that have to do with them? This is so... Thank you. This is so realistic in the sense of how the real world is right now. Like, that's what people need to understand. Tell her! Tell her! Gabby, you go understand you think? You put the cry, yo. The feet that. The bad Oh my god, I'm sorry. Okay, I'm gonna come down. Bro! Falco! The violin! The See, in the worst part, Go killed her mom! See? It's all just full circle. And now she's even more. Yo, this. Yo, this is dialogue, bro. I got. Gabby. Gabby, you're gonna have to learn to. Re you're gonna have to realize eventually, bro. My boy Falco keeping it real. See? See? They can. This is why. Yo, I was. Okay, I was trying to say something. So I thought that was Sasha. They did not just do that. This, yo, okay, I'm sorry, bro. I'm sorry. Like. This is one of the cleanest. This, yeah. Oh my god, bro. Oh, I gotta pause it. I gotta pause it. I'm sorry. Just so y'all know, I'm reading all of the subtitles. I'm good at multitasking at this shit. I'm becoming a master at it. But like, this dialogue. This, yeah. This is easily my favorite anime right now. This is like, bro. I'm about to fucking cry, bro. When I tell you the way they just keep coming, but this is like the most realistic story I've ever seen because this man does not miss a T. This man, every character has a reason. Everything that happens, and even the part that of all people, Sasha doing that, which Gabby shot Sasha, like the connection between that, Gabby's the one that shot Sasha, and then that same person that Sasha basically saved is now teaching Gabby, like, why, like, oh my god. I'm running a little bit, but yeah, y'all. Oh my god, this is beautiful. This is beautiful, bro. Sasha's the goat. This is the episode too? That episode where I started liking Sasha a lot. When she started fighting that resolve, I fuck with Sasha so heavy season two, like. Oh my god! Sasha, your legacy has been, yo. You're gonna live on through it, bro. That's her role model, that's who she. Mappa, oh my god. I'm trying my best not to go read this manga right now. I want to so bad, but like, this is a life lesson. Fuck just the entertainment at this point. Like, this is like, every episode, it's just building so much on better, like. They caught on? Yo, if Reiner ever ends up on the side of, you know what? Let me not get ahead of myself. Talk your shit, Reiner. Yo, the f this Mava! Yo, the Ew, Oh, I forgot my preview. You know I love my preview. Ugh. Bro, I'm not ready, I'm not ready, I'm not ready. Yo, I'm gonna be real, like while I love the action in the other episodes, like, and they, they were just god tier episodes, like, I feel like this might be my personal favorite episode. It just connected with me on such a personal level, like, just what people need to realize in life, like, bro, stop putting that blame shit on everybody else, like, everyone deserves a chance, everyone, yo, that girl, Kaya, I think her name was, yo, she the star of the episode. I never knew she would come to be such an important character that Sasha, the goat Sasha, saved. And I don't care anybody says, I still, I don't know, I was about to hate Gabby for a second, I'm not gonna lie, she killed her. I would have said, all right, bitch, fuck you. And if I learned that that's who Sasha saved after, okay. But she got stopped. I just, I understand why she's in some, in, you gotta understand the mental state is a strong ass place. You wanna help as much as you can and break people out of those types of mental states and shit. That's kind of like a goal of mine. Like I know I can't change everybody or some shit, but if I see something with somebody like that, I know I could help. Personally, not like I'm perfect or anything, but like, you know, help them get there to realize, all right, what I'm doing is wrong. Let me try and correct that. Even though I know it's a pattern of my behavior and what I've always been taught, but I can break that behavior if I have enough guidance around me and I'm willing to listen, which I want Falco to do for Gabby. And I feel like what y'all don't understand, if you like Falco, you should like Gabby. Cause like, I guarantee you by the end of this season, Gabby is what's about to bring out the best in Falco. Like Gabby fire and all, but like Falco is about to be a star, bro. I feel like he's gonna be the most important character when it's all said and done, honestly. I don't know what side he's gonna end up on. I feel like they want you to think he might end up on 
the Eldians, but I don't think he's gonna like the you know the pure the island devils, the Eldians. But like, I feel like he's not. He might not switch up on them, but like he might just find like in the middle or something. I don't know. I'm pretty sure he's gonna survive though. I feel like he's one of the few that would survive. Not. I guess I'll go fuck myself, but yeah, that that episode was amazing. I I'm sorry. I might have to recap episode ten for y'all later because I just can't think right now. That shit just. Like episode 10 was good and they were building up some points and I feel bad for the story, etc. But this episode just got me like Ooh, that that was something else. This is this is beautiful. This is a master. Yeah, this is this is my favorite anime right now. Don't ask me what's my favorite anime anymore. Rizzo, pretty fucking fire. It's up there, but they haven't gotten to the point in their story yet where they could build it to this. Are they building it there and getting crazy? Yes, like all the plot points just keep building. But this, this is where artwork has just reached its maximum. This man has planned all of this so far ahead for years. Like, man, I, I don't know. I heard One Piece could be, is on this, like, this type of stuff too here. With, like, the world building, just how exciting it is seeing characters come back. So that might be there, but I haven't, I haven't watched that or read that. So I can't, I can't include that. But Attack on Titan, masterpiece, easily. Like, I, I'm, I'm losing my shit, but... That's enough ranting. I appreciate y'all tuning in. You know what I'm saying? If you like the episode, leave that like. Hit that subscribe button. I appreciate it. Go crazy. Don't be afraid to tickle it. Just feeling a little lonely down there. And let me don't uh let me know down below in the comments what you thought of the episode as well. What you think might happen next. I don't know what building just blew up. I think that was in Marley, I'm not sure. But we're gonna find out. Appreciate all y'all, man. And as always, make sure y'all go crazy.